Hello everyone and welcome. My name is Baba Tunde and you're very much welcome to my channel. Today, we are going to continue from our previous video on standalone components, which is now at the time of recording this video, stable. In the last video, we talked about the benefits of using the standalone API in your application. And one of the benefits is making your application modulus. That is, creating an application that has no root module. All right. Let's dive right in. All right, welcome back. One way we can achieve this is by ensuring that all of our components in our application are standalone, okay? So that means all of the components in the app.module.ts file, this component, that is the app component and the home component, we wanna make them standalone, all right? That's the first thing. So let's go over to our home component and make our home component stand alone. All right, set this to true. And you also you want to import the common module. We are done with this. So let's go to the app component. We also going to make this stand alone, set this to true. And import the common module okay we no longer need this so I'm going to comment this out then let's go over to our routes.module and remember our learn component is a standalone component now our home component is now a standalone component we can as well make our home component um, we can as well lazy load our home component. I think we should do that. Let's lazy load the home component. Load component. All right, so I'm going to import the home. Dot home. All right, so we no longer have need of the engine module. Take this out. One thing we want to do right here is to export our route. So let's export this guy. Okay, just basic clean up. Okay, so we can as well rename this to route. Um, it's no longer a module, so let's rename it to route routes.ts and let's go over to our hub component.ts we want to import our router module here okay good because we are calling this guy so we need to import the router module so let's go to our main.ts this is where we are going to achieve our modulus application so we want to bootstrap let's let's comment this out so we want to bootstrap our application. All right, and this actually take, takes two parameters. The roots component, which is our hub component, and it takes a config. So we're going to put our providers here, like so. And then we are going to import providers to complete the rescue. And we want to add our router module here. And for root route. So add our routes there. Okay. So let's take this out. Let's take this out. Okay. So let's go over to we have an area here. Um router outlet is unknown. Um let's see what we are missing okay this is standalone let's restart the server server is loading making sure that we I've checked all the boxes. Okay, cool. It's loading now. All right. So our application is working. 
and home component learning component nice so we have achieved a modulus application this application right now has no module has no root module thanks to the standalone api and we can achieve that by having no modules at all just standalone api smooth sailing all the way and remember what we did um, we made all of our components in the app directory we made we turned all of the components in the app directory to stand alone set it to true here don't forget to import the common module and we went over to app.module we just comment everything here we don't have any need of it again and then we came to our route and then we exported we are currently exporting the route and then we remove the module and we turn the we lazy load the home component all right that's it that's the end of today's episode um catch you on the next one